It's been such a pleasure being president and representing the Guild of Sacred Art these past two years. 2019 was a whirlwind of meetings, but 2020 came to a halt in March with a virus no one could have foreseen. But the Guild managed to meet enough to set goals. The Guild was able to donate $10,000 to Sacred Heart for their use plus Christmas bonuses to each employee as a thank you for such a challenging year. Thank goodness the Blanton's Garden Tea was still a highlight on June 7th. Patty goes the extra mile to create a special theme for her guests with all funds be raised going directly to support Sacred Heart. My children used to have a favorite saying, sometimes you can't go over it, you can't go under it, you can't go around it, so you just go through it. Millie, Rachel, and Kim met those challenges head on seeking grants and donations to keep the doors open. That in combination with our volunteers, the gift shop has had another banner year. Spring and fall flowers were still planted. The bake sale became the Holiday Open House Guild Bake Sale and the Festival of Nine Lessons and Carols still happened, but became a virtual event, which was quite a challenge for Millie. Volunteers, you have given of your hearts, time, and money to make the Guild the best yet. As for myself, one accepts a challenge with certain concepts in mind, but winds up being the one blessed to have served such a wonderful group of people. Thank you for having me as your president. Before you today is the upcoming 2021 Guild of Sacred Heart Officers. I will introduce each one and give you their uh, office and tell you a little bit about them. And aware of it or not, each of us writes a page for others to see and to illustrate how people leave a mark on those around us. Actions, words, and deeds become the pages that are written for others to read. Officers of an organization are no exception. Together, they write an entire chapter of our history. To ensure that the pages written are positive, the officers must strive to complete their various obligations promptly and effectively. This group is, combined, is comprised of dedicated leaders. Today, the officers of the Guild of Sacred Heart will be given a pen as they are installed. These pens will contribute to the writing of this group of volunteers next chapter when the officers use them to fulfill the duties and tasks of their respective positions. Geraldine Rinker. As our parliamentarian, your pen will be to the assist the president by giving advice on parliamentary procedure between meetings and by answering parliamentary questions during meetings when requested to do so by the president. Thank you. Patty Pulaski. As treasurer, your pen will be signing checks, balancing the checkbook, making out treasurer's reports, and other duties will include collecting dues, paying bills, and keeping a complete and accurate record of all receipts and disbursements. The page you write is in the world of money management. It is a page that will keep members informed as to this club's financial status. Congratulations, and may your mark always be in black. <laughs> Vicki Coley is our corresponding secretary, but not with us today. And, but her pen will send advance notice of meetings, responding to correspondence, and making notations on incoming mail. The page that she writes will, in, is in the world of communication. It is a page that will keep members and the community informed as to this club's happenings. Congratulations to her, and may her mark always be in bold script. Joan Vanover, our recording secretary. Your pen, whoop, if I can get it, will be keeping accurate records of attendance and proceedings of all executive board meetings and general club meetings. Your minutes are the records of the Guild of Sacred Heart and you are the keeper of these records. The page that you write is in the world of history. 
It is a page that will remind members of their votes and decisions. Congratulations, and may your mark always be precise. <laughs> Thank you. Barbara Fieber. Your pen will be responsible for planning programs for guild meetings. The page that you write is in the world of information and entertainment. And this year, you also have the unique assignment of president-elect and that will find you working closely with the president. You will also perform the duties of the president when she's absent. The president-elect will serve as chairman of the nominating committee. Congratulations, and may your mark always be exciting. Cecilia Tom. Ladies, take a bow, please. Okay. As president, you will be the executive officer of this organization and reside at all membership meetings. The president also serves as an ex officio member of all committees and of the Sacred Heart Cultural Center Board of Directors. You'll be responsible for scheduling all guild board meetings, work with all chairmen and committees, establishing and eliminating as needed. At times, your pen may never cease to write as you fulfill your many obligations. You must be tactful, courteous, conscientious, and always loyal to your office and your membership. The page that you write is in the world of development. It is a page that will inspire members to reach beyond their past to the new future. Congratulations, and may your mark always be one of encouragement. <laughs> Although the officers have been given pens, they do not write the club's next chapter alone. Everyone contributes to the writing process so that the chapter composed during this next administration is the best chapter your club has ever written. The best way I would describe our group is with a poem about sharing. When we share laughter, there's twice the fun. When we share success, we surpass what we've done. When we share problems, there's half the pain. When we share tears, a rainbow falls rain. When we share dreams, they become more real. When we share secrets, it's our heart we reveal. If we share a smile, that's when our love shows. If we share a hug, that's when our love grows. If we share with someone on whom we depend, that person is always a very true friend. And what draws us closer and makes us all care is not what we have, but the things that we share. As my first act as president of the Guild of Sacred Heart, I have the great honor of thanking you. Your time as president of the Guild comes to a close. I want to express our sincere gratitude for your service. Board service is the toughest volunteer job and you took on the presidency with dedication and beautiful grace. More than your amazing ability to connect with volunteers at the 2019 Garden Festival and your willingness to support every function the Guild had at Sacred Heart, I am most grateful for your active leadership as a judicious steward of Sacred Heart 2020 did not give us many opportunities to gather together, but you were working behind the scenes with Millie to make sure any event that we were able to present went smoothly. As a famous peace activist once said, wisdom is knowing what to do. Virtue is doing it. You are both wise and virtuous and I am grateful you shared those qualities with the Guild as its president for the past two years. Thank you. Thank you.